to the people over on YouTube, welcome back. This is going to be the full tilt part of the VOD. And this is Lost Exiles by Max. These are just different knights. Lost Cavaliers. So, however you say that. And then we have La Premiere by Duncan. There you go. And then we have Knights of the Gate, which are these guys, by John. And The Virtuous Three by Dan. And these guys are The Errants of Virtue by David. And then back to these guys by Max. These are all painters that I just realized. Alrighty. Going full tilt with a new get with a new twist on a classic minigame on Warhammer Plus. Oh. Okay. That's this week, the Battle Report crew turned their eyes towards a jousting tournament, tournament in Old Bretonia. As, updated, as an updated version of the classic game, Full Tilt comes to Warhammer Plus. Once more, you can play it at home, too. We caught up with Sir, Nif Sir Nicholas uh, the Tall to give us the laydown. What is that noise? Oh, it's a train. That's pretty cool. Nick. Knights of a certain age may remember a classic Warhammer mini game called Full Tilt, the written published back in 1997 in White Dwarf issue 215. Written by the great Nigel Stillman, it pitted teams of Bretonian knights against each other in a grand tourney to win honor and virtue through the noble art of jousting. I really like that they're bringing this back. Like, that's the old artwork from it. That's a really, really cool picture. Okay. Earlier this year, the Warhammer World Events Manager, Steve, a veteran knight himself, wrote a new version of the game to celebrate the release of Warhammer The Old World. Attendees at the game launched an event at Warhammer World in January, formed teams and jousted all day, with much merriment had by all. Hmm. So it's a newer version of the game. And so it is that we present this brand new edition of Full Tilt, which you can download and play yourself. You'll need a, all you need is a deck of playing cards and three Bretonian knight miniatures per side, and away you go. I wonder if you can still get, still get the old, the old rules for this. It'd be nice if they released the old rules and the new rules, old rules for the old rules for the people who originally played it, and new rules for the people who didn't. And just like compare them side to side and to see how the game has changed. Maybe it's a little bit more fleshed out. Maybe it's a little bit more easier to play. Maybe they fix things. I don't know. I think that'd be neat. I think that'd be really neat, chat. Okay. So how does it work? Well, first each wait, first each player forms a team of three mounted Bretonian knights. To each knight, a knightly virtue is assigned, which gives them a bonus in the game. Okay. Bloop. Roll to see how many favors each knight has received from the Lady of the Lake, which are used to reroll dice. The knights then charge at each other one at a time, looking to break lances upon the armor or shield of their opponents. Break the, <clears throat> break the most lances or force your opponents to retire through injury or shame of being unhorsed. And the joust is yours. Win more jousts, claim overall victory. As you see, the Grand Tourney on the Battle Report was hard and a honorable fought. Honorably fought. Sorry, my bad. Again, I have old man eyes. It's really hard to read this off my second monitor. It is quite, quite small. Again, these guys, these guys are my favorite. I like these guys. They're all bloody and battered and beat up. But here we go. Now you don't need to create a full jousting train set. Wait, now you don't need to create a full jousting train set, but for our special episode, we did that. Okay, well, it would be nice, kind of cool to recreate this. And this is just them going over it. I'm not going to read this whole thing, but. There you go. There's the download right there. And then there's something about subscribing now and some 
dogs. So that's 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 cool. I like that the the rules are free. I wish they would bring back some older stuff for free. I think that's something that they need to do. Alrighty, what is the next topic that we're going to do? Um, did I pass one that I was supposed to look at? We got him. Got that one. Not doing those. He is one we're going to do. But I think I'm going to save him for last. Let's see here. Look at this stuff here. Um, gorgeous. Sorry, this is an impulse. This gorgeous force of fallen dark angels is enough for us to make us uh, make us forsake our vows. All right, let me see here. Boop boop. These are really nice models, but I think these are custom built models. Let's see here. Yes, I think. But these are really really cool. I'm not going to read this article. I just want to show off these models because they are really, really cool looking. Yeah, he. Th these are kit kit bashed. Chat. These are kit bat. Kit kit bashed right there. That right there. Uh, this this model is my favorite right here. This chaplain. Let me just. Oh, it won't even let me scroll. That's a shame. And then that's his kit bashed cipher. It's converted cipher, I should say. Very cool. Very, very cool. All right. We're going to go back on track. We're going to look at one more right here. Brush up on your Legio herald, herald, heraldry and prepare for... Titan Death. Alrighty. Yeah, I hate when it won't let me. Fortunately, it won't let me do this, but this is Legion Ostrom. Yeah, it's not letting me. I do like the heraldry with the the skull. I think that's very, very cool. And here's another one. I can kind of sort of drag these chat, but this is Legiono Solora Imperium Hunters. What, oh, these are this is Nova Guard. Nova Guard's very cool. And this is house, house something. I can't read that, but again, very very cool. Oh, this is death heads. Hell yeah, chat. Hell yeah. This is an awesome model. Right there, or awesome painting, I should say, and the heraldry is quite quite cool. Legion Mortis. Another one, Death Stalkers. Ooh. Do you like the the, ske the skeleton animals there? Let's see, we've got tiger eyes here. Whoop. Next we have Godbreakers, which I think is really cool. It's got that's awesome. It's got the Warhammer right there. House Divin Divini Divine. That's cool. Oh whoop. I'm sorry if this is cut off chat, but this is 
the best that I can do without like giving away my IP address and everything like that. House Etherin, I believe that's how you say this. House Malinax with the awesome scorpion thing there. There's a lot of these. Fire wasps. Death dealers, all right. Purple and black, very nice. True messengers. And then I really like this guy here. These are the Storm Lords. See if I can. There we go. But then I can't. I can't zoom down. It won't let me zoom down, unfortunately. That stinks. All right. I'll probably read this article another day. <laughs> 